Hello, today I'm going to show you how to use green screen by Doink. So to get started on green screen, what you'll need is some videos of yourself or what you're recording and some images to put either in front of you or behind you. So to get started, it's a very simple app. It's a video editing app. So it looks like this when you open it up. In the top corner, you'll see a plus that you tap and you create a new project. Now to get started, you need to give permission for the app to use the microphone and the camera. Now it looks like iMovie, but down the bottom there are three timelines. The three timelines are really important. Your video usually goes in the middle timeline. So the middle plus I'm going to tap and I'm going to tap on video and give permission for the app to access my photos. Okay, and I'm going to add a video that I've recorded of myself in front of a green screen. Now this is why this app is called green screen because what it does is it deletes green. Now you can't see the video at the top of the app. That's just a little glitch. So to see it, you push play, pause, and then you can see the video at the top. Now the video doesn't look perfect. You can see bits of green, you can see the wall, you can see the pole, you can even see a bit of plastic in front of my hands. So to tidy this up, I can do a couple of things. I can tap on the crop tool and then move the cropping in and I can move it this way as well so that way I don't have any of the background but you can still see the green behind me so I'm going to tap on the green color wheel and I'm going to play around with the sensitivity now the sensitivity is not perfect but I can get it just about right where the green deletes and none of myself deletes so there we have it the great thing about this app is with two fingers, I can also pinch and zoom and rotate and put this video wherever I want. Now that the green's taken out, I can add something behind me. So the bottom plus means something will be behind me. So I tap on the bottom plus and I want to have an image behind me. All, tap on the forest, use it. Now because the forest is behind me on the bottom plus, it doesn't delete that green. This app knows that that's the picture that I want behind. But if you have a look at the bottom of my app, I can move it to where my video starts. So now it looks like I'm in the jungle when I'm speaking. Now this image goes forever and ever and ever. So what I want to do is go to the end of my video, tap once on the forest, tap again on the forest. Then I need to tap trim. So now I have a video that goes for 11 seconds. Now what if I want to put something in front of me? Now in front of me, I don't need a green screen. I can have any video I want. I click the top plus and then image. I've created this image in Keynote that has green as the background. So I push use and because that's on the top plus, it will delete the green as well. So now I have three layers of my video. The middle is myself, the bottom is the background, and the top is what I have in front of me. So play around with this app. You can trim, you can add more videos if you want, where the vertical line is, and you can be really creative. So I can't wait to see what you come up with. Good luck and have fun with Green Screen by Doink.